The stress of the spotlight is getting to Travis Scott as him and Kylie Jenner had a massive fight in New York. Oh God, and Tristan Thompson may be acting like a change man, but based on his recent behavior, he definitely is not. And while on their post-engagement road trip, Justin Bieber and Haley Baldwin were caught doing what? We're talking about all these things right now on Holly Scoop's Daily Rewind. <laughs> Happy Friday, you guys. Welcome to Holly Scoop's Daily Rewind. I'm Madison Hill. And I'm Kate DeRocher. The first thing we're talking about is Kylie Jenner and Travis Scott because they have just been in the spotlight nonstop this week, mm -hmm. in the news nonstop. Are they having a baby? Are they not? Right, like so what's happening? Going on. What's happening? So this basically all started after their eye-popping GQ cover. I mean, the Kylie straddling situation. Ooh, it was steamy. We could talk about that for weeks and weeks and weeks. But Kylie and Travis were spotted in New York this week, and it was not a celebratory trip at all. Not like, you know, I pictured it kind of like, we just were on the cover of GQ. Yeah. Like, let's go party Might have a in, bun New in the oven. And, like, it's a good trip. Let's go. No. no. Um, first, the two were spotted at the New York hotspot Carbone, but in an odd turn of events, the two were seen rushing out about 45 minutes later, which, you guys, that is not enough time to have a nice five-star meal. Mm, not not a you. steak. No, not, not a good enough one. time. So whatever they were fighting about, they obviously took to the hotel room because shortly after, Travis was seen storming out of the hotel with his backpack. This is terrible news because I feel like this is one of their first like really big fights. So I know. It's really sad to see, and especially it was, when Stormy's so young and they might have a baby. Yeah, the and it was caught in public, which is like oh. the worst. Um, an onlooker told Radar Online, quote, he seemed angry and was walking really fast. It was super abrupt. Their bodyguards didn't even notice. And when they figured it out, they had to chase after him. The eyewitness continued to say, quote, it definitely looked like Kylie kicked Travis out. Some ish is going down, Some you guys. Some ish is going oh. down. What do you think it is? So we're going to talk. Okay. I. I don't know exactly what it is, but I think we're kind of on, you're on the right track about everything that's been happening this week. I just think Travis is over being in the spotlight. Mm, it has been intense these past couple days. Um, like we said, ever since they're covered, there have been several reports floating around. Exactly what mm -hmm. you talked about, how does Kylie have a bun in the oven? Should we know she wants more kids? Something there is definitely mm -hmm. happening. Um, and the fact that we reported yesterday she's hesitant to marry him right now. She's worried about gaining unnecessary attention, which seems odd. It doesn't make any sense. I mean, babies and weddings are That's normal. A lot of attention. Right. Yeah. And I feel like normal people would argue those are really big, big topics. Mm -hmm. That's something normal people would argue over. So <laughs> think about being a celebrity and everyone watching you and waiting to see what you're going to do. That's 10 times more pressure. Yeah, definitely. And I feel like Travis obviously knew he was going to be in the spotlight, but the mm -hmm. Kardashians are like next level fame for so he's like this is maybe too much for me. I completely agree. And you're right. During their interview with GQ, Kylie did reveal that Travis isn't totally cool all the mm, time yep. with the attention he's getting from dating her, uh, but he quote deals with it. Oh, but you know, it's it. kind of like whenever someone like pokes that annoying yeah. thought, like eventually the person's gonna blow. Yeah, dealing with it is not gonna like last you a lifetime. No, for mm -hmm. sure. And I feel like that everyone just like pushes buttons and this whole argument mm -hmm. happened and he must have said something for him for her to kick him out. I mean yeah. that's pretty big. When he's seeing le like seen leaving with a backpack, you know the guy's not coming back for the night. Maybe okay? it's the pregnancy hormones <laughs> and she's like extra angry. Yeah. I don't know, I'm just saying just Does another hand. She's like, take your toothbrush <laughs> and GTFO. Um she did go on to say in the interview that she tries to go the extra mile to make sure he's able to like do his own thing and it's not always Kylie and Travis, mm -hmm. but clearly something this week did not go right. I'm so curious. I know. I don't know. It I really hope, sad. I agree. I hope that this fight isn't kind of like an end all be mm -hmm. all. I don't think it will be. I no, think they'll work through not. it. Yeah. Um, but they were like one of my favorite couples this week and then this happened and I'm like, what the heck? I know, they've really impressed me ever since having Stormy and they really both stepped up. So it was great to see. So this is not something that I want to yeah. hear about. But I'm guessing it's just normal couple stuff. Yeah, they'll work that's through okay. it. They'll work. Now, something that's not normal couple stuff. Oh no, no, no. Chloe <laughs> and Tristan Thompson. A whole nother story, you guys. All right, let's get into it because you know Kate and I are gonna have some thoughts. So up until this week, Chloe and Tristan have been showing us nothing but solidarity on social media. I mean, remember Tristan's Snapchat of the two of them kissing, I his can't. little Instagram picture with his two kids, and Chloe has defended him numerous times on Twitter, Chloe, like girl, so many times. It's such a bad look. He exactly. On you. But continue on. We get it. Basically, it looks like in Chloe's eyes, all is forgiven. Mm -hmm. The cheating scandal is in the past. Now, although Tristan may be acting like he's changed, he hasn't because you know, once a cheater, always a cheater. I came up with a lot of ways to say that this morning. <laughs> oh. I was like, a leopard never never changes its spots. Oh, okay, and, like, Madison. All this stuff. I was trying to switch it up, but no matter the saying, it's true. It's true. Um, a new report from Radar Online states that Tristan Thompson was back to hold his old ways during an SB after party this week. A source reported to Radar Online that this was the first time Tristan has 
gone out by himself since uh, True's birth and the scandal and that he was acting like a quote free man who took quote full advantage of his time away from Chloe's watchful eye. So just what, what is he thinking? Because he knows there's going to be a ton of people there watching him, watching his every move, reporting on his every move. I just don't understand if he's going to do these things, how he can be so dumb about it. And so out in the open. Yes. I don't understand. The source went on to say, quote, he had the biggest smile on his face and was flirting with several cute girls and took one in the corner and exchanged numbers. Okay, okay. No, this is what kills me. The okay. source maintains that Tristan was, quote, real slick with it. Of course he was. I'm like, oh, like he was real slick with it months ago when he was oh, caught on right? video going into a hotel with another woman. We all saw that video. We saw the video of him with the two girls at the club. Like, he, he is not good at laying low. He's like, not. You're not slick with it, okay? You're not, so why are you trying to do it? You're just uh, not. Um, apparently, Chloe had a feeling something like this would happen. Girl, why didn't you listen to your gut? Um, she didn't even want him to go out, but of course he changed her mind. Um, the source said, quote, he convinced her he had to make an appearance for business reasons and to catch up with his friends since everyone was in town for the ESPYs and she fell for it. She should have gone with him, A, or B, not be with him. Those yeah. are the two options here. Well, I'm just like, I know people say, you know, how, we don't know what the source is saying. I'm, I a thousand percent believe it. Sure. People, when they see Tristan Thompson, are on the prowl to catch him in the wrong. True. And this was in the wrong, obviously. So I just feel like, I don't know. I know, hopefully it's not true. I, I have no words, I can't even get it out. <laughs> but I right? No, it could be speculation, but we've seen in the past that what we've heard about Tristan is true, so I wouldn't be surprised if No, I think this is again. a thousand percent true. I mean, mm -hmm. obviously we don't know if he's gonna act on getting like act on this girl, but yeah. getting her number yeah, that's a no go. Like I'd be so mad. No, no, no. Yeah. Chloe, you better be. No today and not in a good way. Okay, let's next move on to Jaylee. The Biebs and Haley have been going all over the place these days um, ever since they got back from the Bahamas. They were spotted in New York, then so they lucky. were in Miami last week. Onlookers told E! News, quote, they seemed extremely happy and loving. Then they were in Atlanta. Um, Justin took Haley to one of his like favorite teenage spots. It was actually Aww. really cute. The restaurant owner like That's posted really all these sweet. pictures on his Facebook. Like so he was just like, oh my God, Justin Bieber and Haley Baldwin. And they were like holding the menu. It was really funny. Oh, how cute. Um, but now you guys, they're in Washington where they got caught doing some interesting activities. Ooh, la, la. Ooh. <laughs> They were making out. Okay, get your heads out of the gutter, people. <laughs> um, some squealy fans caught Haley and Justin mid swapping spit and asked for a picture. So uncomfortable. So uncomfortable, <laughs> but Justin then called the girls out for getting their shot already, but he was definitely joking. She did, and she did both of these girls. Did. I, I, yeah, you can take a picture. I'm actually surprised that Justin didn't freak out on these girls. I know, he handled it pretty well. Because in the past, when fans have tried to approach him mm. and take pictures, we know that he gets kind of abrasive and yes. he's like, let me live. Yes. But Especially when he's with his lady, yeah. he doesn't like that. He was I totally guess. fine. Yeah. And I mean, the girls offered them their congratulations. They got the picture. Um, the fan posted it to her Twitter along with the video that you guys saw. Um, and the two definitely seem happy, which obviously, how could they not? They just got engaged and they haven't been doing anything except try yeah, I mean, did you see the ring on her finger? I'd be yeah. pretty happy too. I, I mean, just, absolutely, we can make out on the side of the road. Going totally around fine. Washington like this. Oh, hello. Check it out. I'll take a picture. Hello. 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 <laughs> exactly. All right, you guys, let us know what you think about all of these stories. What do you think about Travis Scott and Kylie Jenner having a massive fight in New York? What do you think about Tristan Thompson just going back to his old uh -oh. ways? at that SB after party. You guys know we're really upset about it because I couldn't even talk. <laughs> um, and last but not least, tell us what you think about Justin Bieber and Haley Baldwin getting caught making out on the side of the road. Getting it on, They okay. are so in love. Uh, talk it out down there in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you guys here next time on Holly Scoop's Daily Rewind. Bye guys.